Mmm, it's an orange juice. What's up, everyone? It's OJ. Today, we're going to be playing for the Reach for the Stars Challenge. Now, we've got a lot of things going on. We're 12-2. I haven't lost any game yet, except for the two that I've lost. Now, I set it up so that I could continue. I want to I want to see this new continue feature, if I can lose. It's going to be 100 gems to continue. Pay to continue. That's kind of interesting. I, I'm 14-4 in the global tournament. It's whatever. But holy smokes, look at Air Surfer. 90 wins Four losses. He only drawed four times. What the heck? What kind of deck did he use? I don't even. I don't even know. Was that? Did he use Expo? I wasn't watching. He just. He just climbed 40 wins while I was sleeping. I'm gonna get my bonus reward just to show you guys how it goes. So I did get a legendary chest. That was so worth it for 500 gems. I got. I got like 20,000 gold. A legendary chest. A lightning chest. A giant chest. Let's do it up. Boom. Gold. Gold. Lightning chest. I don't need the lightnings because I'm already fully maxed. It's all star points here on out. Yeah, maybe I do need rascals. I've been donating like 10,000 of them. That's good. I have everything that I need. Skip through all that. Now we got the legendary chest. Oh, oh shoot. All my legendaries are max. It's going to be t a thousand star points, is it? Yeah, a thousand star points. I'll take it. I'll take it. Nice. Blasting through all of these. I just want my giant chest now. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Got some rascals. Got some hunters. Star points. Star points. Star points. That's a lot of gold. That was worth the 500 gems. That's pretty sweet for me. Alright, so 12-2 in this challenge. Let's go for a tombstone in the back. This is... I'm using a musketeer deck. Oh, yes. He ain't got nothing on this. It's gonna lock onto one skeleton. I've got royal recruits. Oh, I don't think log's gonna stop them. I don't think log's gonna stop them. Uh, maybe my tombstone might not be enough. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for the miner. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Why would he go in for the expo immediately? That was aggressive. At least he got 500 damage on the right side. I'll, I'm happy with that. Now in the back, he's up for elixir. He's up for elixir. I don't like this. The roller cruise cost seven elixir, but they're still really good. I don't regret them. I don't regret play. Oh my, what the fudge? Look at this guy with his level three expo star power jazz going on. My goodness. Oh, jeez. This guy's so aggressive. Let's do uh, two roll recruits on that side. I, I need to take up the expo. That is that is some, some scary expo going on. You know what? I want that archer alive. I want that archer alive. There we go. He does, he does 2,000 damage because he's aggressively playing the expo with no regard to anything. So I'm going to take out his other tower on the other side. Not bad. Here's the thing with Expo. You go 1-0. You can't go 2-0. I prepare myself. There we go. Takes out the Fire Spirits. I'm, I might need to use the Archers. Well, not really. I could have afforded that damage. And now I'm down 3 Elixir. And he's going to have Expo. So I should not have done those Archers. I should have just let the Knight do 3 hits on my tower. Oh. I don't know what he wants. He wants to do the Expo. Oh, okay, I thought he was going to do Expo right there. Oh, dear. I, I mispredicted it. Oh, no. This is how we lose. This is how we lose. Okay. Calm down. We got a tower. We're going to play the roller recruits on this side. On the left side, actually. Because I want I want four on the left side. He's, he's going super defensive. Yeah, I mean... Now I'm just going to play the musketeers in the middle because he doesn't have fireball. Split two on that side. He doesn't have fireball yet. Yet. <laughs> I said yet. Yet. Oh, jeez. Let's do real recruits two on the left side. And we're going to support that musketeer. He's going to have a bit of a harder time because he's going to try and Tesla all that stuff. Oh, jeez. That is one aggressive fella. It's going to be a lot harder for him just because he doesn't have the expo. Well, he does have Expo, so it's going to be really, really hard for him to plant it there. I mean, he's going to fireball my Musketeers. If he has the Elixir for it. Slow and steady. I'd rather he just fireball the Musketeers than my tower, so we're good. It's like, whatever. He used Expo, he used Knight, he used Fireball for the 3M. I can dig that. I'm going to go for the Roll Recruits for the Distraction Technique. And we're going to start poisoning him out here. Oh, yeah. One hit on the miner. That's all I asked for. That's all I needed. Now that the roller recruits are tanking for everything, I've got the archers on that side. Oh, he planted a good knight. That was a really good knight. One archer. Does he need that one archer to die? Oh, jeez. Okay. You know what? I don't care. I don't care. 
Uh. Oh shoot. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Is Expo locked on? Oh jeez. I had to use Tombstone in the Expo. That what? What a joke. Here we go. We go in for another poison. It's gonna be one more rotation. I just have to not be stupid again. I'll be good. I'm just gonna play the Royal Recruits right on top of the Expo. Did you think it was gonna be um, Musketeers or something? We're good. We're super good. Let's uh, let's. He's gonna think I'm gonna put it on the inside, the high risk, but I'm gonna put it on the low risk. Okay, never mind. I tried to reverse reverse psychology and it didn't work. He blocked my miner completely. <laughs> there we go. We're 13 2. We got a legendary token. Okay, let's get back into the challenge. All right, Jack Daniels. This is gonna go in for the miner with a really safe spot. We're gonna put it a little bit not so safe in case he has tornado, in case he has something crazy, but he doesn't. So we're just gonna go roll recruits in the very back. Roll recruits are gonna go in the very back and they're gonna kiss the ghost before he connects to the tower. It's gonna be all good. He's splitting his bats, he knows. Well then, I'm gonna split my bats too. Let's poison those uh, barbarians. My bats beat his bats. Ooh, E-Drag, that's gonna be very value. That's gonna be super solid for taking all of my roll recruits. I love how Barbarian Barrel doesn't take out the archers anymore. Archers are back, baby! Archers are back, E-Drag! I don't like this E-Drag. Oh dear. Shoot. Don't. If it made it retarget onto the Barbarian, that would have been so much damage. That would have been so bad. Roll recruits taking out the last wave of Barbarians, and then we're gonna split the no, we're not going to split the bats. I need to take care of that magic, that flying machine. All right, well, he went for the fireball. He's down a lot of elixir, like a lot. I'm going to block that flying machine with my archers. And, uh, good enough. And that electro dragon is not enough to stop all of the royal recruits. There's too many of them. They're so tanky. It's way too much. I'm going to have to use the barbarian barrel for that. I mean, can I activate right here? If I can time it? No, no, no. His new load time is wacky. I should have just blocked it or not used the Barbarian Barrel at all. Oh, no. He does have Fireball, so I shouldn't do that. I'm going to split my Roller Coots in the back. Just bring it out a bit. He's going to have the bats for that. I'm going to split my bats, maybe. We'll see how he goes. Is he going to Fireball anything? No, that's, that's, that's too juicy not to poison. Wait for it. Boom, into the poison. I'm gonna have to split my archers. Those those bats on the right side. I really want to play muskets. That's dangerous. Yeah, that battle ramp is kind of scary. So protect the musket. That's what we need to do. Oh my goodness. That royal ghost is trouble. Why did I play Tombstone there? <laughs> because the Barbarian Barrel is threatening, that's why. All full of misplays, but this deck is so OP that it doesn't even matter. I'm going to put the Roll Recruits in the very back here. I'm not going to do Muskets because I'm very scared of his Fireball right now. It's, it's still in rotation. I'm still waiting for him to play Fireballs for no reason. Nah. Nah, we're going to do two Muskets on that side because I want to pressure the left side. Okay, that's going to be really, really good value there. I wanted him to fireball that side because I actually want to take out the left side. So this is where he's going to have trouble with. And then there we go in with a uh, miner there. A couple hits on the tower. And then this time I'm going to go in for a tombstone. Oh shoot. That ro ghost! All those bats. I definitely need to block that flying machine. It's way too much for me right now. Barbarians are tanking. That flying machine's dealing a lot of damage. The flying machine is why I'm gonna lose. Oh my goodness. Ah, poison that. Might as well. He fireballed. He didn't fireball my archers. He didn't fireball my archers. Barbarian Barrel does not kill archers. And that's how we win, even with a plethora of misplays. Uh, all of the misplays in the world, this deck is overpowered. Split pressure archetype is back, baby. You got the archers, you got the bats, you got the royal recruits, you got the musketeers to split everything. We're 14-2. I better not lose. I don't want to hit continue. That's 100 gems. This is still my free entry. All right, Nathan. We all know what's up, Nathan. Oh, I have my, my new emotes.
There goes one dollar. Fourteen zero. Let's see if we can go fifteen zero now. We're fourteen one in this. That's my favorite emote. The minion is so cute. I'm getting the minion plushie in the superstore in the supercell shop. It's gonna be super fun. Goblin gang's gonna be okay. Maybe I'll I'll pressure with uh oh he missed. He used barbarian barrel on that side. We're good. We're, we're totally good. Those archers are going to take care of the minion horde. Not really. Not with that bandit there. Dang it. One more skeleton. I needed that skeleton. Alright. We kind of traded damage. He's going to deal a lot of damage to my tower. I dealt a lot of damage to his tower, but he's going to deal a bit more. Roll recruits in the back. We're going to split this. It's going to be very good. No, we're going to we're gonna go for the barbarian barrel. That's how we roll. That's how it rolls. <laughs> Bats for that. Barbarian barrel is not going to make it through. Go in for the miner as one roll recruit tanks for the miner. The miner's gonna deal a lot of damage. A lot of damage. Extra damage, actually. Is that bandit gonna die? No way. For real? Yeah, it's, it's good. I can't believe I have to use tombstone to defend that, but <laughs> it works out. Split. My archer's kind of right there. And, uh,. Roll recruits, four on that side. It's not enough. Oh, it, it was enough. Roll recruits are so good. At seven elixir, they feel so right, so strong, so overpowered. You know what? I'm gonna surprise them with musketeers. I haven't seen, I haven't seen anything crazy yet. <laughs> and I haven't seen any fireballs. Too late. My musketeers locked onto the tower. There we go. Roll of recruits to defend. Nah, no, I'm gonna go for tombstone first, and then we're gonna go for roll of recruits after. No, 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 poison, poison. That's where the money's at. Barbarian barrel, that stuff, and we're good. Boom. 15 wins with one continue. 20,000 gold. No chest. Oh, that stinks. Th th there's like no chance for a legendary because you don't get a chest. Now I kind of regret using my 100 gems on that. Oh, man. Oh, did this get fixed? Is it gonna like ask? Is it gonna like roll again? 50, 50 gems! Wow! That's actually not bad. It got fixed, finally. Alright, that's it for the Reach for the Stars challenge. It's gonna be super fun. There's a few decks out there. There's uh, Tag is the Barbarian Hut Roll Recruits deck. I prefer this one just because it's more splitty. You, you have all these four cards to split. This defends against Battle Ram. This defends against all the other stuff. Minor, Poison. Really, really versatile. Good luck in the challenges, and I hope you guys don't have to use the Pay to Continue feature for that. Have fun.